Welcome back to more of the Gaming Blind with Sam Bam Let's Play of Darkest Dungeon. Guess what? I can build a thing. It's only taken me how many episodes and how many hours to do this? I've been wanting to do this for such a long time. Two bottles of the blood brewed every week. We're going to do it. I've never been able to do one of those before. It feels kind of neat to finally have something built. So I'm at least going to have a little bit of stuff that I can, that I, I'm not going to have to worry quite so much about running out of blood. Fingers crossed. I probably will anyway. Who knows? Anyway, now I have no busts, which kind of sucks. Uh, Lord knows I want more busts in my life. But in the interim, I am going to go for a cove quest. I think that was my plan anyway, because... There's there's not really another good option here. I could start doing level 5 quests, but I don't want to. I'm scared. So I'm going to do this quest, which makes me activate three protective wards. And the the reward is decent. The solar crown's okay. I forget what Gentle Tide does. We'll find out once I finish this quest. It's a, Oh, I thought it was a short quest. I was going to say, I'll just do short quests. It's totally easy. No, I forgot. It's actually not. Oops, I forgot to level up my character's abilities again. I did it with their their weapons and armor, and I forgot to level up their their... their skills, which I really should be doing, especially for the leper, considering that he desperately needs oops, needs some sort of accuracy buff for, like, everything. Let's see. What was this? Okay. I wasn't necessarily going, planning on spending so much money to level up these characters, but I kind of need to. Uh, what did I even have for you? There was Stab, sure. Uh, what was, what did I have set up for her? So I had Flash Powder and Protect Me. Okay. What was this one again? Uh, fortifying Vapors. Uh, I'll, I'll stick with the Flash Powder because I can I can de-stealth an enemy with that. So this is sort of a money run, but it's kind of risky to do a, a, a medium quest as a money run. But I'm going to do it anyway because I just spent like 20,000 gold upgrading characters. So I'm going to do that. So we have our Leper with the Fortunate Armlet and the Sun Ring to boost his accuracy as much as possible. We have our uh, Highwayman with a Drifter's Buckle and the Ancestor's Candle. We have our, um, I almost said Churchin, or our Vestal of Churchin's Charm and Sun Cloak. And we have our Antiquarian with Candle of Life and the Book of Intuition. I don't know how this is going to go. But I guess it's not really that much of a concern as how it's going to go. It's just this is what's going to happen. So, okay, we start with all the items, which kind of sucks. It's not great. Uh, we are going to need at least a full stack of shovels. Uh, do we need anti-venoms? Probably not too many. Um, if I brought a Plague Doctor, I wouldn't even bother bringing anti-venoms. <sighs> do we need too many of these? I don't think so. Uh, we do need a full stack. Oops, we don't need a full, full, full stack like that. Let's take, like... Okay, two keys is, or three keys I think is fine for that. Holy water, I don't think we need too much of. Uh, none of our characters have the, the thing that shall not be named. Okay, and we have no space again. <laughs> okay. This might be one of those ones where I camp super early. Maybe. We'll see. I don't know. If I camp super early, then I at least have an extra space in my inventory. Although it would be a waste of food, but... It's it's fine. It's no big deal. We'll see how big this um, place is. I didn't bother to check and see if any of my characters have a way of preventing nighttime ambush. Probably should have done that before I went in here. Do you have... Um, okay, we have bandit sense. That's the most important thing. That's fine. Okay. Did we get a scout? Oh, we got a scout. Neat. Okay. So, let's see here. So, that is a... Okay, that's just a regular curio. Another regular curio. Okay, there's a quest location right there. That's great. Okay. And another curio, another curio. Okay. So, we're not going down that way. Oh, this map sucks. Okay. I want to see what this curio is. It's a shovel right at the start. I don't like that. I really don't like that. 
because I only have four. Okay, one quest location there. I'm going to risk this. I probably shouldn't. I probably should have brought an extra shovel. Did I even use the right character? I did. Okay, that's good. Okay, that's pretty nice. I ran out of busts earlier. I'm getting a bunch of them back. I like it. Okay. Go here. What do we have? Torch? Great. I'll take it. I don't know if I can put it in my... Okay. No, I can't. I was like, do I really have space in my... No, I don't. Okay. So we're down to two shovels already. A little bit worried there. But okay. We got our first one of these. That's done. Great. We have a... We space in our inventory. Kind of need it right now. Okay, I'm not going to use a torch yet. Scout? No. No scout, of course. Okay, so that was regular curio. I'm not going to go for any... I'm going to try to avoid as many battles as possible, considering our team is a, a little ramshackle. Okay. I'm not going to bother with the brackish tide pool. I don't need whatever healing properties it has. Why? Why? Screw this game. Come on. This party is not built for this fight. I'm I'm not doing it. I'm not doing it. Are you kidding me? What do I even do? Is it going to come back? Is it still there? Or is it a regular battle that I can maybe have a smallest chance in hell of winning? I'm assuming not. Is it still the same thing? Okay, we're not we're not doing it. Or can I not escape now? Nope. We're just giving up. I've lo I'm losing a bunch of money. I don't care. I am not dealing with that with this party. Absolutely not. No chance in hell. I could have camped there, actually. That was dumb. I should have camped there. I know. I don't care what I got. I should have just camped. I am not dealing with that. I am sorry. I am not dealing that with an antiquarian. Not a chance. Okay, well, I guess we got to figure out a new plan of action, and we have to heal all of their stress now. Huh. And I have no money, because I spent all of it to get ready for this quest, and I have nothing. Okay. Do it live, apparently. Is there like a... Um, medium veteran, is there like a medium... Short Apprentice. Is that a Apprentice? Okay. Book of Holiness. Alright. Where's our Ramshack? What are you doing in there? Oh. I guess it takes longer to uh, fix stuff. Okay. Let's do a let's do a high level dungeon then, I guess. Let's do a short dungeon, because I have no money, and I can do nothing else. What do we want to do here? Eldritch Slayer's Ring? Or what was that one up here? Eldritch Slayer's Ring or Eldritch Slayer's Ring? Hmm. I guess we'll do the... I guess we can just do... Let's just do this. What a mess. Okay, what do I even do here? That was atrocious. I hate this game sometimes. Okay. Let's bring you. Hmm. Let's actually bring Abomination, maybe? And just anyone. Any Vestal, please. Okay. I need to check a few things. I'm not doing I'm not putting them in for stress healing because I don't have any money anymore. Oops. Are all your stuff leveled up? Um some of your stuff isn't. 
I can't even afford to level anybody up here. That's the sad part. I don't even want to bother. I can't afford it. <laughs> so is anything changing here? Like, did I get new recruits here? No, it's all the same. Interesting. I don't even remember if I looked at the trinkets. Not that I can afford any of them now. Doesn't matter. Uh, I'm probably going to have to sell a couple trinkets, actually, in order to get through this short quest. Okay. What do I even want to do here? Okay, what do we have? Stone skill chance. Not bad. Plus 15 protection. Plus 35 move resist. Minus 15 stress. Minus 2 speed. Minus 2 speed's fine. It's no big deal. I can use a feather crystal to increase the um, increase the speed back up, I guess. Not that that matters that much, but still, whatever. Okay. What do we want to give you? We have so many... Uh, stun and Blight chance, I like that. Minus plus 15% protection. Yeah, sure, let's do that one, and... Yeah, 15% protection seems to be good. Let's give you Lucky Talisman, and... Do you just want to do Book of Intuition? We're not going to be doing a lot of damage with this team. We're not giving them any, like bonuses to damage, but whatever. Okay, give you Turgeon's Charm, and what? Some sort of protection would be good, I suppose, but I don't know what else I can... Okay, no, wait, Suncloak, maybe? Isn't there something that gave me plus protection? I just have to find it, that's the thing. Uh, where is that? Suncloak? Yeah. Okay. Thanks, game. On the plus side, I don't have to worry about camping, since this is... No, we're not going into that one, thank you. Uh, yeah, we're going to go for... Well, let's see, that's crests. What do we get for this one? Deeds. I think deeds are more valuable than crests, so we're going to... No, I really should go... I'm just going to go for the ruins. I was planning to go for a ruins quest. That's what I'm going to go for. Was this just... 90% of rooms? It was 90% of rooms. Okay. That's fine. So we'll take one stack of food. Two shovels is plenty, I think. I think two anti-venoms is fine. Two bandages. Three medicinal herbs. Three keys. Three holy waters. One... Let's take a couple extra torches. We don't need any blood. Okay. Let's try that again. Please don't make me fight that thing again. Oh, that's so annoying. I didn't even I didn't even put anyone in for stress healing because it was it cost so much money. Uh, yes, I probably could have maybe stood a small chance, a snowball's chance in hell of defeating that thing if I had stopped and camped, but I don't think I would have had a chance to defeat it. Okay. We go up. I was expecting an immediate trap. So I'm glad there wasn't one. Okay. Busts are good. Busts are great. Give me all the busts directly into my face, please. There's the trap. Mechanical hazards. That's a lot of damage. Alright. I don't remember if I brought any extra torches, did I? I brought a couple extra. Okay, that's fine. No scout. Oh god, I forgot what it was like to not have scouts. Oh, I don't like it at all. As the light goes I really don't like it. Is very uncomfortable. Oh, I think I forget if this was a. Is this one new for the level five dungeons? I don't remember. Oh, he must be because we haven't seen any of his attacks yet. I don't remember what he does though. Okay, so he has pretty decent blight resist actually. Well, they all do now. Okay. Uh, do you have armor? No, you don't. We have very high dodge. It's gonna risk it. Huh. That's unfortunate. Okay. Pretty glad that missed, actually. Uh, let's go for... I probably should have gone for the Bulwark of Faith, actually, but it's fine. Did he dodge? No, he didn't. But that's fine. 
Okay. Can I get rid of one of these? Confidence Wonderful. As the enemy okay. That's fine. Three damage is very manageable. Uh, let's try it again. Actually, I should have gone for flashing daggers there, probably. Eh, it doesn't matter now. Okay. I'm really glad that that thing keeps missing. And I'm glad that I can keep my abomination in his human form. Do I want to go for a bulwark here? Let's do it. At least can boost the torch up to back up to 100, which I think it was already at, so that's fine. Uh, this thing is... One HP away. That's fine. Now it's one HP away, but slightly differently. One HP away. Did you? Oh yeah, you took stress damage from that uh, trap earlier. Let's heal. Now that I think about it, since that other thing doesn't have a chance at surviving, so eh, whatever. Really, everyone's going at first now. <laughs> fine, whatever. Okay. Pretty good. Nice amount of money there. Alright. Starting to make up very slightly for all the money that we lost in that last dungeon. Okay. No scout. This is really unpleasant not getting any scouts. But I don't have anything that I don't have any classes that I think guess have like an inherent scouting chance. Oh, who has the lowest stress? 17, 6, 5, 2. Well, it was worth a try to get a map. Oh, God. Oh, God, they're faster. Ugh. Oh, boy. I didn't use... Uh, oh, jeez. I didn't get a chance to use a torch before these things attacked me. That's what I was trying to say there. Okay. Um, oh, you're poisoned. Unfortunate. Okay, good. Okay, I thought we almost got rid of both of them. Not quite. Uh, flashing daggers would probably be a bad idea right now. Okay. Good. Unfortunately, our abomination is still marked. Plus, I'd maybe I can stun this thing so it can't attack. Wonderful. Okay, let's just do that. Get rid of it. Whew. Okay, vial of blood's not bad. Even though I can produce my own now. It's okay to have a little bit extra. Hey, we actually got a scout. There's a whole bunch of stuff there. Also, no enemies. Well, except for that one right there. Do I go back that way for that curio? I might. I very well might. Okay. No map. That's fine, though. I need everything right now. <laughs> Even the journal page I'll take for, like, a minute before I get rid of it very shortly afterwards. Good. Need that stress heal. I personally need the stress heal. Okay. Who's at the... You're at the lowest amount of stress. Let's try it. Stack of books. It keeps happening with the books being uninteresting. I swear the light's going down faster now. Is it just me? Is it just me or is the light going down faster? It really feels like it. I don't know. Do I check this curio? I kind of don't want to. I kind of just want to press forward. It could be really good, though. But we're also surprisingly out of space. All Well, no, we're not kind of out of space. But we're close enough to being out of space. I got to check. If it's like an urn, it's going to give me a whole bunch of gems, then it's worth it. It's, uh, okay. I can use this. I think I need medicinal herbs for it. Uh... Worth it. 
waiting to be spoken. I'm actually going to go this way rather than backtrack the whole way because I don't want to have to walk all the way back. Okay. I mean, we're going to have to walk back either way, but I just would rather walk forwards all the way back. It makes sense. Just believe me, it makes sense, please. Okay. How many torches do I have? Six? There's one, two... Okay, we're going to use one right before this fight, because I don't want the light to be very low. Oh... Well, so much for our stress levels. This is not going to go well. Okay. That's decent. Okay. Good. Hmm. It's 15, I think it's 19. Uh, probably should have healed there, actually. Okay. I don't want to bulwark because I'm afraid that if I do... Oh, he's stealthed. Damn. I can still hit him like that, though. Really wish I had a plague doctor right now that was available to uh, just poison everything. Stop critting! Oh my god! She's at 72 stress! It's been two battles! Okay, this thing has six. It has, I think it's. Okay, it's blighted for six. So we're fine. Please heal yourself. Maybe crit? Thank you. Okay. 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 Whatever. He's fine. He can deal with it. He's a big boy. Okay. What are you blighted for? You're blighted for eight. You have nine HP. You're blighted for eight. You have 14 HP. Okay, if I do the zealous accusation again, it's going to get rid of that one. Okay, good. Really hoping I get to go first, but no, of course not. Oh god, Vestal's already at just an unhealthy amount of stress. I'm going to waste a turn to try and get her to both heal herself back up. Another crit is great, but she's still at way too much stress. It's not good. All the money in the world is not worth this much stress. Okay, we get rid of that. I want the crests. I think I can drop the vial of blood. I shouldn't, but I'm going to. Okay. That was still a really bad fight. And I don't want that to happen again. I'm sure it will, though. It's, uh, it's bound to happen, knowing this game. So we have four torches left. Okay, great. It's another fight. Please don't be as bad as the last one. Okay. This is much more manageable than the last one. I'm pretty sure anyway. Good start. Uh, unfortunate. Really hoping to get one of these things blight resists. 80. It's like a 70% chance to work. Okay. Cool. Just hoping for a stress for a crit there. That's fine. As long as you don't target the Vestal, I don't care what you do. There's a lot of loud noises somewhere. Everywhere. Okay, that's fine. These things have very high stun resist, but I also don't care. I'm just trying to do damage to them right now. Huh. Didn't, ex didn't expect the the uh, 
Crusader to not knock out an enemy. I also didn't expect the this other maggot to go before everybody else. Okay, so we got nothing out of that except all the wonderful memories along the way. Okay, I think I can take that. I, I'll take the holy water. I don't know if I'm going to need it. The rest I don't care about. The citrine, I don't remember if I actually had a space for my citrine. Uh, it looks like I don't, so... Okay, um, let's go up. Uh, okay, that's a bad start. That's fine. Even I brought shovels for a reason. Bent on preventing where's, our, where's our light at? I'm going to try to keep the light level very high during this last little... Okay. Last little segment, just so I don't... Uh, so just so mostly I can keep, make sure that my sun items... Oh, okay. Okay, so no scout, but I do want to see... I'd really like to see what, if anything, might be down the other way. Because I've explored the entire dungeon up to this point. I just want to... Did I have enough food for one more check? Okay, I do. We're fine. Please don't make me regret my decision, game. Wow. Here's the next food check. Hope there isn't another one in this same corridor. A handsome reward. Okay. Oh my god, we're, are we actually going to take a, a journal page home with us? Means, that'd be absolutely crazy. Okay, we're out of torches, I think. Okay. What is that? That looks different to me. Bone bearer? I don't remember ever seeing that before in my life. So, this is going to be interesting, I guess. Okay. So it is extremely resistant to bleed. Obviously, it's a bone thing. It's okay. It's totally resistant to stun, has very high dodge. Okay. I'm going to work on getting rid of the arbalist first. Because that thing is always annoying. Wicked Surge. Okay, so it's going to buff. Okay, two seconds. What did that do? 20% damage to inaccuracy. Hmm. Not great. These things have 45% protection? Jeez. All right. So I'm going to stun the one who's been buffed. Or at least try to. So the buff... Uh, gets, that's going to last for a long time. Maybe I shouldn't have done that. Okay, that sucks that I that it, I missed the uh, missed the attack on that thing. Coral. Yikes. Uh, <laughs> I gotta heal the party. I have to heal the party. Oh my god, they do so much damage. How do they do so much damage? Okay. I'll be really happy once I get rid of the Arbalists. They're all doing so much damage. Oh boy. So... Both of... No. So this thing was buffed twice? Now it just has a permanent 25% damage buff? Okay. I don't quite follow how this is all working, but I guess we're just going to go with it. It keeps dodging my attacks, too. I can't hit it. Oof. Okay, this thing has... <sighs> Come on. Okay. <sighs> I'm going to start working through these things. Say foul warding? What is he blocking? What is he protecting? This thing, of course he is. Of course... Jeez. Alright. I'm just gonna end up barfing on both of them then. That's fine. The more of that I can get, the better. Okay, that thing's gonna die next turn from Blight, no matter what. I'm just gonna... Okay, how much Blight is on this thing? 12. It has 9 HP. Wonderful. Can I Blight this guy? Good. 
just gonna blight everything down. I don't really have a better option. Can this thing only buff other characters? It's only done it's only buffed other enemies, or it's only buffed the enemies so far. It's done nothing else. Good crit there. Kinda needed it. Good. We got one of them. Can I stun this thing? Great. So at least it'll take its blight damage. Okay. Mm -mm. That thing is very resistant to stun, right? I hit it. It's a miracle. Okay, we got the quarreler. Or, sorry, not quarreler. I mean, it uses coral as its attacks. It makes sense. This thing is getting buffed to high heaven. Thankfully, uh, it's uh, it's gonna it's not gonna survive very long. I'm pretty sure. Okay, we need to heal the crusader. Okay, this guy is done from blight next turn. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, ten. Okay, so this thing is resistant to stun. Can I hit this thing? Oh, I I hit the wrong thing. Unholy Rally, does he bring more? Oh. That's the other thing he does. Okay. Good to know. So he just does that at the end of each turn, or whatever turns, I guess. Okay, now that I'm actually, now that I'm actually hitting him, uh, I was concerned that, like, there was no way I was going to hit him because he kept dodging all of my attacks. Like that. Okay. Uh, I'm going to heal the... Let's heal everybody again, actually. I really need to heal... Well, you know what? It's... Ugh. It's not good, mind you. Okay. I was going to say I really should heal the um, Grave Robber, but she's actually fine. Like, she can't be hit at this point, I think, by the um, this guy. So I think we're mostly okay. Wow, that was a huge chunk. I think this thing, yeah, this thing's dead. Okay, great. Let's stun this thing, because I can't barf on it. Okay, never mind. Okay, that thing was a little scary. Remember that thing I said where the Grave Robber can't be hit by this guy? That was the one instance where he could, where now she can be hit by this thing. Of course. Uh, I think Blight's better. Not much. I mean, I should have honestly used the... I should have used the... I don't even know what. The Armor Piercing Attack, that's what I was trying to say. Stun. Good. Okay, well that's interesting to know about that new enemy that I hadn't seen before. I'm gonna try this and see how much more damage it does. Yeah, I should have done with the armor. I should have gone with the armor piercing. This thing's dead anyway. It only has three HP left. We're fine. Really? There we go. Much better. Okay. Holy crap, that's a lot of deeds. Okay, I don't need the shovel. Take that. I don't need this journal page. Sorry. Do I have keys still? I do. I will take those. What do I drop? I know. I, I know I have a full pack. Uh, let's just drop... I don't need the torch. I don't need that. Uh, I don't know which one of these would get me more money, so I don't really care that much. Let's just drop the medicinal herbs because I have three of those, or two of those versus three of the other thing. Okay. That went okay. Mostly because I didn't run into any giant, horrible mini-bosses right at the start of a dungeon. A little bit of money. 17,000 gold is not bad. I can probably sell this Sun Ring. Or, sorry, Eldritch Slayer's Ring. Four busts, two portraits, eight deeds, 16 crests. Not bad. Somehow our Vestal survived and didn't go mad. Hieromania gifted. Lost Cove Tactician. That kind of sucks. And Covephobe, okay. Spasm of the Entrails. Wonderful. 
And Warren's Explorer, but I lost a musical. I think I'm okay with losing musical. Okay, that went kind of badly, but we did we did still manage to uh, we pulled it through, and uh, yeah. All right, um, that's kind of bad, but it's all right. Like I said, we pulled it through in the end. Bunch of level one heroes. Don't really care. Sorry, guys and gals, not interested. See, we have for trinkets that I can't really honestly consider affording or buying at this point. Camper's helmet. Agility whistle. Blight charm. No. Okay. Cool. Thanks, everybody, for watching this episode of Darkest Dungeon. Please click the like button if you enjoyed the video. And subscribe to the channel for more of this. And I will talk to you all next time.